I hide my wide mostly because it's cool. It isn't intricate hiding. I just don't leave my weed and paraphernalia out like a dumbass. To the untrained eye, a normal giant la cream cone. One out of two. Bang, pop the top off that bitch in my 21 inch bong is the treasure. A normal giant ice cream cone. Hey space. So I was wondering if anyone would be able to tell me some good telescope brands. I was looking to buy a telescope for my stepdad for Christmas but I know nothing about them. I don't really want to spend more than 30 to 35 dollars. If anyone knows what sort of features should I look for? For 30 to 35 dollars your best bet would be to grind down two panes of glass into a rough lens shape with some rocks, then glue them to the inside of a toilet paper tube. Then spend the money on weed. Weed, there's something bad happening in the 410 area code. Yesterday my friend brought over an ounce of something he called Thor's hammer, it was red and furry and smelled like holy hell. We rolled a blunt of the shit and passed it back and forth, eventually I passed out after the blunt was halfway done. I woke up this morning and noticed I was cold as shit. Then I noticed I wasn't in my house, but an unfurnished loft, still wearing the clothes I had on yesterday. I ran outside and after a little investigation I found out I'm in Bergen, Norway. I'm using a library computer at the moment, in my pockets I have a Norwegian passport and ID, I'm planning on going over to the American embassy and trying to figure out what the hell is going on, but I'm worried. I also have a receipt to a Norwegian bank machine, but no card. Anyway if you're in the Maryland area stay the fuck away from Thor's hammer. Laughing my fucking ass off. Be parkering. Wearing Batman costume because it's Halloween, feels appropriate. Find an alley that looks promising, decide to smoke a spliff while I plan out my route. Halfway done when someone taps on my shoulder, says excuse me. Turn around, it's a cop. He says I don't think the Batman would break the law. Panic for a second, then remember the easy roof access. Decide to ham it up and say in my best Batman voice then. You don't know the Batman. Corner jump up a wall, run along the top of a fence and leap up a building. Get to top of the building, look down. Cop looks fucking baffled. Hear him say into walkie talkie I think I caught the real Batman smoking weed. A few months later, I bumped into the same cop on the street. He asks me to stop for a second, saying I look familiar, but can't place my face. My face won the whole ordeal. Live in a very rural community with farms, mountains ranches surrounded around us. Never really had weeds around but my friend said he knew a guy and called him up. Tell him I live at the bottom of the mountain near the lake. Shit man that's far and I don't wanna waste the gas, I'll find another way. Wait about two hours waiting for him to come meet me. See two horses in a carriage. What the fuck dot jpeg. He pulls it up right next to me and my friend. He gets out drunk as shit wearing a Santa costume, it was near Christmas. I got bud yo shit so dank ho ho ho. Proceeds to get out a red trash bag. It's full of weed. Probably a pound in all. Oh shit jolly African American. Gives us weed and he gets back in his carriage. As he's turning around his carriage flipped over and his horses fell down. Me and friend run up to him he gets out and starts yelling. Some random guy sees and calls the sheriff and fire department out. Has still yelling and bleeding, blood coming down over his fake beard. Cops show up and he tries running but gets tackled and handcuffed. A couple kids who came to see what was going on saw Santa all bloodied up and handcuffed. Guy gets arrested for DUI but then the cops found his weed and charged him for possession too. We still have ounce we just bought. We walk away. Went home and smoked a bowl trying to comprehend what just happened. Never saw Guy again. His horses ended up getting killed because they were injured. Haven't had a drug dealer since.